What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Bed Wars. Today, we're going to be taking a look at the current rotation item, the Lucky Chest. Now, as you can see, it spawns a Lucky Chest with random resource drops. Everyone watches me for my React content, and I will be reacting to what is this guy possibly doing? I will be reacting to what I get from a Lucky Chest. You guys are all going to pog out. Um, everyone knows that my reactions are just the best. Holy smokes. And we want him down from there. And he's off the edge. Uh, very good. And now let's take a look. Uh, I don't think I used my gold. I didn't. So let's buy a lucky chest and see what it has in store. Is it any good? Absolutely not. I got three... Actually, I think I got one gold in return. 40 iron. Glass and clay? What... Like, how is anyone going to get this and think it's worth it? Is there a chance to get emeralds? Because then maybe I could see a use. But we're going to keep buying them, and we're going to see if we can get anything good. When I use items like the machine gun bow, I made a video on that not too long ago. Items like this make me realize why nobody uses the machine gun bow. And it's because there are, there are certain items that are so incredibly bad that it makes it so there's just no point in even buying one of these. Like, this one was okay. One diamond, one emerald. Still not amazing, but we're just going to keep buying it, see what we can get this time. Uh, looks like a couple more diamonds, so... Just the fact that the loot table is filled with things like wood, clay, and glass really just makes it not worth it at all. But uh, we're going to go ahead and buy another one, because why not? Um, some more diamonds, two of them. And I went back to my base, where I haven't been in a while, because uh, now I have 14 more gold, so I can buy almost three more lucky chests. Unfortunately, as you can see, you can only buy 10 per game. I have four purchases remaining. So, unfortunately, I can't just buy infinite. I mean, not unfortunate, because I wouldn't want to, really. But, like, look at that. I got only blocks. Oh, thank goodness. I got 10 more wood and two glass. This is so great. Um, at least this went 20 gold. Okay, I mean, that's, that's pretty good. I can at least buy more lucky chests. So, thank you for the bonus gold. I have now maxed my lucky chest purchases. Let's see what we can get. Only glass? Glass and wood? This is crazy. Okay, a diamond. It is so bad. I guess it's called a lucky chest. So if you feel like you want to play the lottery, um, go ahead and open them. Maybe there's a chance for getting a bunch of emeralds. I haven't seen it. I've only seen various blocks. And I was thinking of making a video on the other item too, the block shuffler. But like, what's even the point? It just it shuffles player placed blocks and like... I can think of one use case for that. That would be if someone placed down Obby, and I haven't even tested if it can move Obby, but assuming it can move Obby, like, that's the only use I can think for uh, using the Enderman block shuffler deal. Okay, the tree almost kills me. Every time, by the way, I don't know if you know that, every time I will uh, be dying to that tree. Hello? Hello? Uh, okay. Oh. They hit me with a fireball, but that's too bad that they couldn't break my- What is this? Okay, it's only me and Pink left. Uh, the game went relatively quick, probably because I spent the whole game opening lucky chests. Uh, with my one emerald I got from the lucky chest, I bought a jump boost potion, which will surely help me a lot. Um, I'll drink it right now, actually. Hey, there we go. <laughs> uh, they'll probably live that fireball, that's fine. Um, are they running back to their base? They're running to gray. They don't have a path to their base. I have, uh, eight diamonds. Can I buy- I could buy prot three with this. Um, I probably should. I'll head over to their base. Do they have fireballs to hit me with? Looks like no. Yeah, we'll just keep running in here. And can I break their bed? They have obsidian. Holy moly. Now, this isn't the end of the world. I've talked about this before, but obsidian in solos is not exactly the most worth it thing. Because now that I got this kill, I can just buy a diamond pickaxe. I'll have to kill them again once they uh, come back to life here. Hello? Now you only have a wood sword. I'm really sorry, but you have to die. And now I just break their bed. It's generally not worth it, I feel like, in solos to buy obby. Um, let me kill them. Actually, why don't I just get them low? I was gonna get them low and then break their bed, but it wasn't gonna happen. It's fine. Um, I am a little bit low here. It doesn't matter. They can't hit me. GG's. G great game there. Uh, yeah, nice obby. And lucky chest. Let's just, let's give it another try. I want to buy 10 more lucky chests next game and maybe we'll get something great. Okay, we're back with another game where I will hopefully be able to buy 
10 purchases of Lucky Chests. This is so exciting. Aqua is ink, meaning I have to go way up into the sky to get above them. They fell in the void. I feel like that's been happening a lot to me where I'm going for my first rush and they fall in the void. What is going on? Have blocks become slipperier? But either way, this gives me a big advantage. They bought a fireball as per usual. Hopefully not two though. Okay, do we think their bed is on those two or those two? Either way, I should be able to break their bed if they get far enough away. Yeah, they're far enough away. Bed gone. Sorry, dude. Uh, shears are too good. Okay, and we have 11. Now, what you should normally do when you get 11 gold is you should uh, buy iron armor. Not me, though. I will be uh, buying lucky chests. So, uh, very good. I have blocks now. This is so stupid. Like, how am I supposed to win games when I'm playing this, this incompetently? Unfortunately, my bed just got broken by pink, which is fine, I guess. I don't... It makes sense that they went for me. I'm the base next to them, but let's just go ahead and get rid of green here. Green went to mid, and now they have diamond armor, so I don't know what that's about. Thanks to all these blocks I have, I'm going in on red. They are... Oh, they tried to fireball me. They, yeah, they're pretty far from their base, so fireballing me is the only option. I would imagine they go for another one. Yep. And another one? It looks like no, not another one. And their bed is gone. They said why, and I... Honestly, couldn't tell you why I went for their bed. Probably because they were far from their base. But on the bright side, we still don't have iron armor, and I will be buying up uh, two more lucky chests because that is just what I am doing today. Um, 20 gold. Yes. Okay, now that we have the 20 gold, I'm actually going to buy iron armor. I'm going to do it. And let's just go ahead and buy one more lucky chest. See what's going on here. Another gold and more wool. But that extra gold that I got actually means that I can buy another lucky chest. So very cool. Um, more garbage, more of nothing of value. I love that. I think killing red is my path to winning. So let's just go ahead and see if I can get over to him. Green died somehow. I don't really know how, but again, we are just gonna be chasing red in to their base. Well, I guess not their base, yellow base. But let's go ahead and smack him around a bit. And GG. That's a good game. I don't know how green died, but I think they just fell off on their own. I can't wait to buy more lucky chests. This is so cool. Um, let me just buy shears and go get my first rush. If I can remove them, I can buy up some lucky chests. And what's the point of playing Bed Wars if it's not for gambling, you know? Actually, I haven't even left for my first rush yet, and I can already afford a lucky chest, so very cool. Um, and 20 gold. Okay, well, we're up to nearly three stacks of wool, so I can just spam it everywhere. So this is really exciting. Um, so much wool. Oh, okay. That's fine. I guess we're bed trading. He was ready for me. He decided to fireball jump. Works for me. I would imagine... Unfortunately for this guy, I'm going to have a lucky chest, so he's in a lot of trouble if he tries to kill me. Check this out. Oh, yeah, let's go. 20 wood, 32 wool and some clay. That is, this is just the best. Let me just see if I can run back here. Are they gonna go for a fireball kill or what are they gonna go for here? Let me just quick buy sharp. And they are standing off to the side. Are they gonna come in on me? I have a sharp sword. You're not gonna wanna do this. Yeah, he knows. Wait, what's he? What is that? You just took fall damage for no reason. Does he? Here, have a fireball. Here, have another fireball. Oh, that one didn't do anything. Hey, I'm not going out on that bridge. I, I don't care. You can... Yeah, come on in. Let's let's just have a nice little PvP fight. Goodbye. And uh, I got six more gold, meaning another lucky chest. This is, this is big news. Because I... Have I only gotten blocks? Oh my goodness. This is the most worthless item I've ever seen in Bed Wars. But on the bright side, we have five more gold, meaning we can open another lucky chest. Uh, this is lucky chest number four, meaning I've spent 20 gold. More blocks. Okay, very cool. Uh, I'm gonna need emeralds if I'm gonna win this game. I have no other shot. I'm so far behind on everything. Um, mid in this map looks so awful. It looks like a bunch of just scattered islands. Like, I feel like no, even if I'm standing in the middle of one of these islands, I'm still in danger of getting fireballed off. This is so bad. Pink is right there, and uh, if they come to mid, I'm probably dead. I don't have gear, uh, so I'm just gonna... Try to avoid them. Okay, I'm gonna try to work my way out of mid now because I need to get to a base to spend these emeralds um, and get more gold to buy lucky chests. That's more important. So let's head to pink. It looks like this is the only base near me. Um, pink seems to not have a bed, so I don't need to break anything here. Um, I have 12 
emeralds. I guess diamond armor and invis jump. Oh, and I can't wait to buy another lucky chest. This is huge. Ready? Oh, let's go. More blocks. One diamond. Actually, I can get prot two from that. So that's not the worst thing. But you know what else could get me to prot two? Just walking over to a diamond gen. That is what, that's the other thing that could get me to prot two. You get kind of a lot of iron. So I'm up to six fireballs. But is six fireballs enough to really do anything? Probably not. Okay, and I'm gonna just punch that guy off the edge real quick. He was collecting emeralds. Ooh, he gave me kind of a lot of stuff. Thank you. Um, I'll just, I'll go invis and run in. I'll see if they have like fireballs. We'll just, we'll do a little fun test here. It seems like even if they do have fireballs, it's not really gonna matter. They're also leaving, so see ya, dude. Let me just head up. Dude, climbing a ladder is so loud. But this guy must not be playing with sound. So goodbye. And, oh, he, oh. He landed on, like, the only block that wasn't covered in water. Um, let's just PvP again. And whack. Okay. Here, I'm gonna build a wall. Yep. And now the water's just pushing him away. Away with your bed. <laughs> no, get down from there. Don't be climbing that ladder again. I'm, I'm coming after him. You're not allowed to go up here. <laughs> Wow, I'm pretty sure I opened like five lucky chests that game and only got blocks and maybe like one diamond and some iron. GG. All right, we're playing on uh, Siege, I think this map is called. I'm just gonna do the lucky chest rush. You know, you know the old lucky chest rush. You just kind of wait for uh, five gold and then buy up a lucky chest and then get really good items such as 10 pieces of wood. So like, check this out. Yep, that's an overpowered bed defense. I'm gonna go ahead and make my first rush because if I can take them out, That'll give me another generator to collect gold, which I can then go ahead and just completely waste. Gray's not in the game. Okay, great. See so, ya. Yeah. But I was right. I have another generator, and we have two more chests to open. One diamond. This is awesome. Can't wait to buy Miner Fatigue. This is going to turn my game around. I'm so glad I've spent, like, 15 gold on, uh, on Lucky Chest, as opposed to buying anything of value. Okay, and here comes another one. That's so exciting, I got one diamond again. So that makes two, I guess I can buy prot, which don't get me wrong, not worth it. I've spent so much gold, but I do have prot, which is pretty exciting. Um, can I just send this guy off the edge? Oh, I can. And his bed is gone, very good. I unfortunately didn't have shears in my hot bar, so that made it a little bit of a, an issue to break the bed, but that's okay, we got it anyway. And I just opened a lucky chest for 20 pieces of wool. That is the greatest use for lucky chests I've ever seen. This is going to give me such an advantage fighting this player. I would expect them to fireball jump to me. I hit them. Nice block clutch. And a not nice block clutch afterwards. I think that person was actually pretty good. So I am pretty lucky that I uh, got him when I did. But better than me taking him out. Because who cares about removing players from the game in Bed Wars? We're here to open lucky chests. Let me just head down into this base. I don't think anyone's been here in a while, so there should be some gold waiting for me. Oh, we are up to 20. Uh, should be buying an iron armor, an iron sword. Uh, doesn't matter. I'm opening lucky chests. And uh, uh, three diamonds, one piece of gold, so many random blocks. What a worthless item. I know I said this in the first game, but items like this is the reason why the good items, like the machine gun bow, aren't ever used. No one thinks it's worth it to even check the rotating items. They're just like, who cares? I think they're over at green or somewhere around there. So away with their bed and I can now buy prot too. I have so much iron. Uh, time for some gold. One diamond. But great news, everybody. I am up to 20 planks and 20 clay. So I could make a sick bed defense if I wanted to which I don't want to for the record. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna build with clay here. That way, if someone tries to fireball me, they'll be able to break less blocks. <laughs> oh, if I wanted to have no blocks break, I could build with glass. Yeah, check that out, dude. Hey, no, hey, he's breaking my glass. Hey, why am I getting spleefed right now? He's not ready for me. Wait, he lived? Holy frick. How did he take so much fall damage and live? And I think I'm out of lucky chest purchases. Oh, this is so exciting. I can actually start buying good items from the game. Where's green? I'm concerned. Green is in the game. Where are they? Are they here? I'll just start heading to red, I guess. I have no clue where green is, but it's all good. Let's just head in here. 
Um, will my leather armor... Oh, okay. I was going to say, will my leather armor hold up in this fight? I guess it doesn't matter if I just one-tap him off the edge. Now, unfortunately, I can't buy more lucky chests, so I will just be buying uh, iron armor, which is a much worse purchase. I'd rather buy 50 gold worth of lucky chests. Um, okay, fireballs. What if we buy golems? Oh, yeah, three golems. This is good. Okay, I'll fireball once directly at the bed. And... Uh, who am I getting fireballed by? Was that red? I don't know if that was red or not, but we'll just keep heading in here. And I fireball jump past, and let's build up a bit. Okay, how does this work? What if I do something like this? Wait, oh, green's here. Wait, where'd you come from? All right, I'm gonna do this. Go get him. They weren't ready. They were distracted by the golem. And bed gone. Let's drop some golems. Let's end this game. Green has to run, but red's here, but will it matter? Golem, go get him. Okay, that that's fine. Um, dude, green is so low from the golems. Wait, he's going to have to be extremely careful getting down because... Okay, that works too. I was going to say he's too low, so he can't like jump down or he's going to die of fall damage. He didn't have to worry about fall damage because he jumped off the edge. Great game there with the lucky chest. I'm so glad I got like 10 glass and that's about it. Great item. Wait, this is so cool. Amazon is still a slow iron map. Amazon was already one of my favorite maps, but the fact that they haven't destroyed this map with fast iron makes this map even better for me. Love Amazon. What a good map. Uh, I see Gray is coming at me, so I will be uh, bridging really high up into the sky. Please go away. Thank you. Goodbye. Gray bed is gone, and I'm only down one heart, so I could kill him here. Uh, I guess he wants to have a block hit war. And I barely won. <laughs> it was just critting each other. Great news, 10 gold in my inventory. I will be buying lucky chests. Show me something good. Uh, 6 gold, some iron. I guess that's enough gold to buy another lucky chest. Here we go. Which gives me iron and more wool. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna go for red. I'm getting a little concerned. They went to the diamond gen and now they're going mid. So red just has free reign of all the resources that they want, which is a far better use of your time than opening lucky chests. Don't get me wrong. I'm opening lucky chests to try to get emeralds and diamonds and they're just going to get emeralds and diamonds, which is way smarter. But some people never learn. I'm buying another lucky chest. Here we go. So glad I now have glass and wood. I don't even have a stone sword, but I'm going in to fight red team. Hello, red. No, don't turn around, dude. Come fight me. Look, you outgear me, probably. If you have a stone sword, you outgear me. Like, it doesn't take much, so just, just turn around and fight me. He might actually try to make it back to his base and buy, like, a diamond sword and then flip around and kill me. So I'm going to try to get real close to him before he can do that. Yeah, looks like he will be doing that. Um, but I'll be following. See ya. Uh, eight emeralds gone for him. And into my inventory. Time to buy diamond armor. I was thinking about buying iron armor, but why would I do that when I could buy three lucky chests? Such good gear. I now have one piece of gold, 40 iron. But look at the blocks that I have. This makes it all worth it. I feel so undergeared, even though I have diamond armor. I don't have any gaps. I don't have an iron sword. So like if I take damage, it's like permanent. I know that I know there's regen, but like like it's not real regen, it's fake regen. So I think I'm gonna run in, try to get a couple of crits, and then hopefully I'll be able to grab the kill. Let me just look out. I don't want him seeing me. And yes, couple crits down. He is out of the game. Very good. I'm going to drink some jump and I'm going to drink some invis and I'm going to start heading towards white. So they still have a bed. So killing them doesn't really matter at this point, but I'm pretty sure they're somewhere in mid looking for me. Yep. There they are. I don't know if they bought a tracker. I'd really like them to not have a tracker, um, but if they start swinging, oh, okay. Um, he's just going to swing his little sword around. We both have jump boost, so he's just gonna come up here. I'll smack him. That's a lot of fall damage. Gapping doesn't work if you're just gonna be taking sword hits the whole time. All right, let's work our way into white. They shouldn't have a tracker anymore, so I can probably just invis past them. So let me just go ahead and do that. Let's see, do they know I'm here? They definitely do know I'm here. But that's okay. They're going to try to run back to their base, but I'll just fireball them off, or at least try to. And uh, we'll work our way in. Uncontested. So let's just 
blast their bed open. We'll go ahead and break it. I'll hit him once. He has no idea. He has no idea where I am. Invis is so good, dude. No hits, and he said I'm really bad at the game. I mean, we only fought twice, and I killed them both times. The second time he didn't even hit me. I guess I was invis, so it's not fair. Well, that's gonna do it for this episode of Bed Wars. Hopefully you all enjoyed. If you can take anything from this video, it's that lucky chests aren't worth it. Go ahead and like and subscribe and use my code on the Hypixel store and Lunar Cloaks. See you in the next video. Bye.